a bit louder. Let's go to the noise floor, bring it up a little. Alright guys, so as you can see right now, I'm going to show you guys how to use the compressor in Audacity. Okay, so that sounds pretty legit, but let's bring up the ratio uh, quite a bit. And uh, let's, let's turn down the noise floor and the threshold a little. Uh, let's hear what it sounds like. <laughs> What's happening guys, my name is Alex, welcome back to a brand new Audacity tutorial and in this video guys, I'm going to show you guys how to use the compressor in Audacity, so I would say make sure to smash the like button down below and also the subscribe button for more videos and I want to mention that Audacity is going to end in a couple of weeks, I'm going to quit the tutorials at tutorial 40, so make sure to also let me know what you guys want to see in the next series on Thursday because I'm actually looking uh, for a new tutorial series I want to upload every Thursday instead of Audacity so if you guys have any suggestions make sure to like leave me in the comments down below and I'll be happy to take a look at them so with that being said let's start in today's video so as you can see we are in Audacity as always and I'm gonna first of all I'm going to record something uh, right now so you guys will see how to use the compressor so let's record something uh, real quick Alright guys, so as you can see right now, I'm going to show you guys how to use the compressor in Audacity. Okay, so this is our audio, so I'm going to uh, put on my headset and let's hear what it sounds like. Alright guys, so as you can see right now, I'm going to show you guys how to use the compressor in Audacity. Okay, that sounds really great, but now we're going to apply the compressor effect on it. So what we're going to do, uh, first of all, is we are going to select all the spoken text that we have right here in the project. And then I'm going to go to effect. And obviously, we're going to click on uh, compressor as you can see now we have a, a, a you know a box popping up right here and right here we have the threshold the noise floor uh, the ratio the attack time and the release time so let's mess around a little bit more with threshold and let's see what it sounds like all right guys so as you can see right now I'm gonna show you guys how to use the okay so as you can hear that uh, makes the sound uh, a little bit louder let's go to the noise floor bring it up a little Alright guys, so as you can see right now, I'm going to show you guys how to use the compressor in Audacity. Okay, so that sounds pretty legit, but let's bring up the ratio uh, quite a bit. And uh, let's, let's turn down the noise floor and the threshold a little. Uh, let's hear what it sounds like. Alright guys, so as you can see right now, I'm going to show you guys how to use the compressor in Audacity. Okay, that sounds pretty legit, but I'm going. you can also mess around uh, with the attack time, obviously. So if you bring that up and this... Uh, those ones a little bit more down uh, the release time also a little less hear what it sounds like Alright guys, so as you can see right now I'm gonna show you guys how to use the compressor in audacity Okay, so that makes the sound a little bit more clear as you can see and you know There's obviously there are tons and tons of ways how you can uh, mess around with the compressor um, but the only thing you want to do is let's say that you're looking for a certain desired effect or a end result I just want to uh, recommend you guys uh, Mess around with those markers as you can see because also the lines are, are starting to move as you can see if I bring up if bring if I bring down the ratio Alright guys, so as you can see right now, I'm going to show you guys how to use the compressor in Audacity. So it sounds really, really cool, but you know, there are multiple things you want to pay attention to. Like, obviously, uh, the top line, uh, you want to keep that on zero uh, decibels, obviously. Um, but if we bring everything down, if, if I, I'll show you guys what it does, uh, it is just going to mess around with the audio completely like so. Alright guys, so as you can see right now, I'm going to show you guys. So let's click on OK. And as you can see, the sound waves are becoming really, really big. So it's probably going to be a little bit louder. Alright guys, so as you can see right now, I'm going to show you guys how to use the compressor in Audacity. So it sounds pretty cool. And the, you know, the, the difference is really hard to explain. But you guys can clearly hear the difference, obviously. So this is how to use the compressor, guys. Make sure to just mess around with the little bars uh, like I showed you guys. So that is it for this video. Thank you for the continued support. And I will see you guys tomorrow with a brand new After Effects as always uh, on Friday. So thank you for watching and I'll catch you guys tomorrow. Just Alex Halford.